Hello Pilates lovers, welcome back to my channel. Any Pilates physical therapist. This is a video for deep hip stretching that you can utilize with a mat and it's an outdoor exercise program just for you. So get your mat ready and join me. Friends, we'll start sitting up position. We're gonna do the mermaid stretch. So one leg cross backward to a 90 degree, one leg on your right in front of you to a 90 degree position. So in this position, you might feel difficult already sitting up. You might be leaning on one side a little bit and that's fine. So let's engage your core muscles in this position. Inhale through your nose, belly button in and blow. And now in this position, you're going to slowly move your neck. Put your hands on your side. Take a deep breath. Belly button in. Look up in the sky. And then down bow. Inhale through your nose. Look up. Belly button in. And down bow. If this mermaid position is difficult, you can do cross-legged for now. Take a deep breath. Belly button in. And down bow. Now tilt your head to the right. Feel that lovely pull all the way to your fingertips on your left and take a deep breath. Belly button in and blow. And now tilt your head to the left side. Now you feel a lovely stretch of your neck all the way to your right shoulder and fingertips down the mat. Take a deep breath. Belly button in and blow. Now slowly twist to the right and look up gently. Feel that pull all the way to your left hip. Take a deep breath belly button in and look down and blow look up again take a deep breath belly button in and down blow and now from this position you're gonna lean on your right elbow and slowly overhead of your left hand to your right and making sure your hand is planted on the mat for support get deep breath through your nose belly button in and back blow it's so nice to do some stretching outside your home fresh air and blow feel the beautiful birds chirping and if you have some water stream at the background that's lovely to hear take a deep breath belly button in and hold that and blow and now you're gonna twist this time to the left it's still in mermaid position and slowly look up take a deep breath and down blow last one to the left take a deep breath and down blow now we mermaid stretch on the other side 90 on your left 90 on your right it's also a 90 90 position and you feel one side is a little bit easier or harder depending on where your tightness that you have more left hand right hand on the sides and slowly look up again take a deep breath belly button in and down blow take a deep breath look up belly button in and down blow inhale up belly button in and down blow last one look up in the sky take a deep breath belly button in and down blow now slowly tilt your head away from your right. Feel that lovely stretch of your right side of your shoulders and your neck. And hold it there. Take a deep breath. Belly button in and blow. And then back to the center. Tilt again to the left. Feel that lovely pull. Take a deep breath. Belly button in and blow. Now slowly tilt now to the right. Feel that pull now on your left. Take a deep breath. Belly button in and blow. Back to the center. Tilt to the right. Take a deep breath. Belly button in and blow. Now slowly twist to the left. And look up. Take a deep breath. Belly button in and look down and blow. Take a deep breath up. Belly button in and down blow. Now lean on your left elbow gently and then overhead 
take a deep breath, belly button in and down below. Overhead again. And tilt your head further down to stretch your right side of your neck. Take a deep breath, belly button in and blow. Last one. Take a deep breath, belly button in and blow. Now we'll do some pigeon stretch, which is left leg forward, keeping your left leg bent. So you feel a lovely stretch on your left glutes. And then right hip flexor stretch and keeping your body straight to feel a deeper stretch on your hip flexors and slowly look up. Take a deep breath, belly button in and look down and blow. Inhale through your nose, look up, belly button in, feel that lovely stretch and down blow. And now we are going to progress by slowly bending your right knee and look up. Take a deep breath, belly button in and blow. And then look down while straightening your knee. Take a deep breath, look up, belly button in and blow. Inhale up, belly button in and blow. Now we're going to slowly lower with your elbows down the mat and you feel a deeper stretch on your left glutes and look up, take a deep breath and look down and blow. Inhale up, belly button in and down blow. Now bend your right knee and stretch your deep quadriceps and your deep hip flexors. Take a deep breath. Belly button in and blow. Inhale through your nose, belly button in and blow. And now you face to the right and slowly reach for your right foot. If this is too aggressive, just continue with just bending your knee because this is sometimes too difficult for beginners. So this is a little bit advanced of a deep stretch today. And you can always slowly progress and hold it. Clasp your fingers and hold this for a few breaths. Take a deep breath, belly button in and blow. Inhale, belly button in and blow. Last breath, take a deep breath, belly button in and blow. Isn't that a lovely stretch? And now let's go to the other side gently. Turn to the right. So this time, your right knee is bent here for your right glute and straighten your left hip forward and look up, hands planted on the mat and gently look up. Take a deep breath, belly button in and look down and blow. Feel that gently stretching your left hip flexor and right glutes. So we're hitting two birds with one stone. Deep stretch. Take a deep breath. Belly button in and look down and blow. Last one. Take a deep breath. Look up in the sky. Belly button in and down blow. And now we're gonna slowly bend your left knee up while looking up. Take a deep breath and then down blow. Down. Inhale through your nose, look up, belly button in, and down blow. Inhale through your nose, look up, belly button in, and down blow. Lovely sound of the nature. Take a deep breath, look up, belly button in, and down blow. Now we're going to further go down on your elbows so you can feel a deeper stretch on your right glutes this time. And now take a deep breath, look up, belly button in, and then look down and blow. Inhale through your nose, belly button in, and down blow. Last one, look up, belly button in, and down blow. 
Now we're going to slowly progress by bending your left knee. Take a deep breath while looking up, belly button in and down blow and straighten your knee down while looking down. And then look up again, take a deep breath, belly button in and down blow. Last one, you take a deep breath, belly button in and down blow. Now we're going to slowly turn to the left. Bend your left knee to reach over and as I said earlier, if this is too aggressive, just continue with bending. It takes time to reach this level of flexibility. So now from this position, you take a deep breath, belly button in and blow. We hold this for three breaths more. Take a deep breath, belly button in and blow. Two more, inhale through your nose, belly button in and blow. So you can really feel the stretch all the way to your shoulders and your neck, keeping your posture straight. Last breath, take a deep breath, belly button in and down blow. And now you're gonna face forward, facing me. We're gonna do butterfly stretch and sitting. Put your feet together and then sit up straight. Keep your length and your spine with your breaths. Take a deep breath, belly button in and blow. And now gently with your hands, slowly lower your knees out to the mat. If this is too difficult and if you're in this level, that's fine as long as you're trying. And then slowly, as the more you do this, the more you lengthen your hip adductors. And then from this, hold this hip in this position and gently look up, take a deep breath. Belly button in and look down and blow. Take a deep breath, look up. Belly button in and down blow. And now tilt your head to the right. Hold it there. And you can put your hands on the mat to feel a longer and deeper stretch on your left side. Take a deep breath again. And back to the center and blow now to the other side the breaths are so important to relax all those tight muscles inhale and blow now slowly twist to the right take a deep breath look up belly button in and look down and blow now twist to the left take a deep breath and look up as high as you can and look down to your left armpit and blow and now we're gonna open your arms apart and hug yourself from this position, you open and hug and blow. Take a deep breath. Belly button in, engage your core and blow. And now twist to the right and back. Twist to the left and back. And now clasp your hands together at the back in this position at the back. And from this, you lift your shoulder up. Hands off the back and down. Lift. And down, last one, take a deep breath, lift, and down. And now we're going to do overhead and lean forward to the floor and up. So now, so you're going to go up and gently go down to stretch. As much as you can, going down and up. Last one, take a deep breath, you can put your feet together and down to stretch your low back. And then lower your knees out and down. Okay. After that lovely stretch, we're going to lie on your back. And now we're going to figure four on your right. Push it out first. Take a deep breath for your piriformis muscles. Belly button in and blow. And now you're going to hug your knees to chest. Take a deep breath. Belly button in and blow. And now you're going to rock left and right on figure four position take a deep breath belly button in and blow and now back to the center now your left side take a deep breath and hug your knees to chest inhale and rock left and right belly button in and blow inhale belly button in and blow and now hug both knees to your chest open your low back muscles and rock left and right take a deep breath 
belly button in and blow now lengthen your legs straighten your knee and down take a deep breath lift straighten your knee and pull towards you more to stretch and down blow inhale up and pull and down last one pull up and stretch and now from this position you open your separate your knees and feet apart and back to the center take a deep breath hold it and blow last one take a deep breath and blow and now start with your left slowly lower your right leg down and slowly pull your body up to stretch your hamstrings more keeping your knees straight if your knee is buckled a little bit that's fine but if you can straighten it more that would be great and pull take a deep breath and blow let go inhale belly button in and blow now lift your right leg and down with your left and slowly pull take a deep breath and back blow last one take a deep breath belly button in and blow gently pull and blow now lift your left reach for your feet if you can't reach for your feet you can go back start on your thighs whatever you can reach your behind your calf ankles and slowly build up to your feet and bend your knees and rock left and rock right rocking like a baby take a deep breath belly button in and blow now slowly straighten your knee now you can really stretch out more and back to the center rock like a baby open to a V stretch and back to the center take a deep breath bend open to a V back to the center and blow bend take a deep breath open back to the center and blow last one take a deep breath this is the last hold open and hold it here for five four pull it more two one and slowly go up to a sitting position and that's it i'm hoping you're feeling a little bit better in your hip muscles and your spine please like and subscribe my channel ring the notification bell for future updates just like this one I upload videos every wednesdays fridays sundays and sometimes mondays for pilates yoga physical therapy and wellness you can also follow me on my social media my facebook instagram reddit and i also have a patreon account you can check out the link below to support my channel thanks again for joining me until next time have a great and healthier you bye